Let's now go to James with the weather. And JT, this is a morning where we wish there was an invention called smell vision where we can smell where you are. Yes. I know, and I wish there was taste division as well. I'm at the barbecue championships at North Burley. We're getting close to judging time. So if you're wondering how a bar barbecue competition works, 20 mm. hours to cook five meats. They're there judged by the judges, and it goes a little bit on presentation, a little bit on texture, but mainly on taste. I'm um, with the Beers Boys and Barbecues team. Uh, this is one half of the team. This is, we've got Brett here G'day. and Chris. G'day, Brett. Uh, now, Brett is... What are you doing there? So just, uh, this is our presentation box. This is how we hand the meat to the judges. Because everyone has to give six portions that fit into that box. Is that right? That's right, exactly. OK, and chicken is being judged at nine. So, Chris, can we have a look yeah, at your chicken quickly? Let's go, bro. So this is probably the, the had the least amount of cooking time of all of the, the meats? It's a quicker one, yes, it is. So what have you got there? Got some chicken thighs with a little special rub. Mm. What's the rub? Rub. Oh. Beast Boys, Beast Boys yeah. barbecue. <laughs> oh, Sweet barbecue sauce. Sweet barbecue sauce. Any, what, is there a special ingredient that makes it the best? Well, golden oh. syrup, because it's Australian style. Oh. You know? So we've got to have golden syrup. Instead of using molasses or something like that, we use golden syrup. And so you've got to give that... six portions, but you've got heaps there. Yeah. Is that just... Uh, trial and error. Basically. And, and also one for me, and we've got, so there's cameraman. <laughs> yeah, we're all I'm sure yeah, you're not. We'll hang around as long as you like. Are they one uh, new right, chickens, luck, boys. Thank you. Uh, so Thank normal, you. normal jobs, a plumber, baker, business owner, you know, so these guys are not butchers or chefs or whatever, you know, they're just, mm -hmm. there's teams from all walks of life and here JT, at you pre present it on a bed of parsley, do you? So it seems. Yeah, yeah. Is that or slow cooked parsley? you can go at market, some people are doing kale. Is it organic? Oh, it's uh, handy. It's, mm -hmm. Is it, it Wagyu is, parsley? Yes, organic <laughs> Wagyu parsley. And Andrew, Andrew thinks the, that, uh, that all from... meat that you hear is Wagyu. Everywhere all of a sudden, you go, it's Wagyu. It's a bit like the pesto yeah. of the yeah. 90s. Wagyu from the Bankstown RSL and it's Wagyu. Fact, getting the curly parsley is one of the hardest things about the competition because everyone's doing flat leaf now oh, and yeah. kale and... Ooh. Poor old curly parsley. You only really see it at the butchers and the RSL these days. Yeah, That's a side note. Let's cartoons. go to the forecast. Mm.